Hello folks, how y'all doing? I am Akari, your redneck pirate, and welcome to the V for Vanilla server, Season 4. Now I missed the start, the big group start, which was uh, this last weekend. I was on a camp out with the scouts, and uh, I got on a little bit Sunday night, did a little bit, found a nice uh, place to call base, um, I had, and then I got busy with other stuff, um, and then I did a little bit today. And, well, I thought I'd get on here and show you all what I've done and the base I've chosen. So, and you can tell I've done a little bit because I've got iron. Um, I got a bow from a uh, skeleton. I have died once from a skeleton, uh, which, you know, I was kind of bummed on that one. I, I would rather my first death be on camera, but that just didn't work out. And it's not a big deal because, as you can see from all the deaths, um, it hasn't even been a week since the server's been going, and there's been a lot of deaths. So we are on, as of today, are on Minecraft 1.11. So 1.11, that's spectacular. And I have uh, claimed a spot, and I built a small, let's call it a boathouse. And that is it right there. And I'm rather proud of it. I think it turned out, oh, if I can drive the boat, I think it turned out really well. So here, let's hop off. Now, spawn is that way. So I am kind of northeast of spawn. About a thousand blocks, or not quite a thousand blocks. Um, we started off on 1.10. And the border was right behind the island. And this is a decent sized island. Um, let's go around here and show you what I got going on. Got a little spot here to store boats if I want to. And things in there yet. A um, little overhang. We'll walk up. I've torched a big area. Uh, let's go in here. And see this just leads out that way. Two ways in and out thought that was kind of cool. I, I saw a picture online that this is kind of inspired from. So yeah, I got some furnaces that are cooking up some stone. Some chests, which these are here came from dungeons. I found three dungeons under here. Um, and I got these saddles, the horse, the three sets of horse armor. The shield is from day one. Shield, everyone got one. I thought that was very cool. I'm going to keep that. I'm not going to use it. I've made a diamond pick, and then these are some of the tools I've used. Uh, my spare iron sword, because I died and I had to run down and kill the skeleton that killed me. Uh, some blocks from mining, and a little bit of sand I've taken out to get this place put in. I got the discs from the uh, three dungeons I found. A couple gold, most of the gold I, already, I, I, I mined. I've mined. I had eight diamonds here, plus the three for the diamond pick. But I was almost dead. I was down to a heart, and uh, I went over chat asking for if someone had stuff to make potions. And Game and Soy gave me three potions, so I gave him a diamond. I figured it was only fair. I have since come up with a couple of golden apples, and I, went, I did go to spawn, and I used. Oh. I can't think of his name now. It's not Kinema, but it starts with a K. But anyways, I used his uh, his um, brewing stand. He said I could, so thankfully I have. Uh, and I did see some nether work growing over there, so I snagged it. I have not been to the nether yet. I will definitely be doing that on camera because I'll probably die. And that is it for the little house. Oh, up here is a bed. Originally I had the bed right here, and then I'd sleep in it and take damage. And that happened twice, so I moved the bed, and that's when I was down to one heart and had to go to spawn and see game and soy so let's go up here um got a nice little path see this grass grow yep grass has grown in and got a little path coming up i have built a tree farm these these trees weren't here and you see i said i i have uh we'll get to that in a minute i have lit a big big portion of it, uh, or this area up then this island is pretty good size uh, I've got a farm right here 
And uh, ooh, I need to harvest it all again. Um, let's run over here. Kind of show you the size of the islands. So it's big enough for me. I, I have a lot of plans. I'm not going to build underground. Except for like a mob spawner. Everything else is going to be above ground. Um, I've even got a sign there saying it's my island. There is a... Um, a water temple, a guardian temple over there. And I got a sign there claiming it because I'd like to get a couple guys together and go uh, hit that, you know, the, the oh, run through that dungeon. I've never done a water temple, so I'm definitely going to have to do that on camera. I've seen it done, I know it's there, but I, I have never done it. Now, I'm my little peedly uh, armor, I'm not ready for that yet. Uh, I have a mine right here. I kind of Made the front look like a mine because you know, it's supposed to look like a mine shaft. So I kind of read down a little bit of the train, put a little path, and then it just goes down there and it's just a mine. That's it. It's just, I originally started with the main shaft going this way and then branching off uh, because, like I said, the, uh, the border was right there. That's since lifted. That's since lifted since we went to 1.11. So yeah, there's that. Oh, uh, what else? Um, that's really it, except over here. There is a cave. Right here, which... I put a little dirt right there. I'll show you why in a minute. But, yeah, go down there to the right. I found a zombie spawner. And a skeleton spawner. And that's what that's going to be. Or, Oh, no, I'm going to go sleep. Because I don't have any of this protected yet. And I don't know if anyone else is going to sleep. So we do have it set. Um, it is on hard mode. Health regen is off. As always, that's the vanilla thing. Um, even on our modded server, it's health regen is off and it's on hard. Uh, but we also, they've set up... A couple of uh, command blocks. One is one person sleeping. Another one is when you kill the dragon, he drops elytra. And when you kill uh, players, they drop uh, the heads. And I don't think you can see it on me. You can't. But when you're looking at people, it'll show their kills. So how many PvP kills they've had above their head. So let's go back over here. And right down here, which I got to do some work on all this still. Uh, that's going to be, see, that's uh, that's where we come out at. So it's going to be a drop shoot. It's going to come up right here. Right there. That's where the, where the skeletons and the zombies are going to come up. And I'll make this look pretty later. And see, skeleton... And zombie, and so anywhere should be anywhere in here. I'm within 16 blocks, so I will activate it. Um, yeah, because by by all math I've done, I should be activating that. And uh, see, can I poke a hole right through here and see it? I've not done that. Yeah, see, it's still active. Mm, yeah, see, it's still active right there. So anywhere in here, and if that one's active, the one that's right here in front is definitely still active. And uh, I don't know how pretty I'm going to make this starting out. Definitely want to get it functioning first. So let's put that back. And right here, zombie spawner and skeleton spawner. So my plan is to let these guys push down to here. Of course, one will be here. I'll have to put a sign right there to stop the water. And it'll push them all down. And there'll be water here, pushing them this way. And a block there of water and there. And it'll push them into this. And then I'm going to go up, over, and down. And I've already got that marked off to 23 blocks up. 
is what that is right there. So that is 23 blocks up to here. Worst case is I have to put a block there. And that won't help with the armored guys, but get a mending sword and no problem. So that is the plan. And then I'll have a nice entrance. I don't have to go through the cave. I'll put a little hut building over this or something. Come in. And yeah. And right here, the skeletons and zombies will come up here and go in there and drop down. And they'll just be dropping together. Kill them, get zombie flesh, bones, and XP. So it'll be great. Um, I definitely, I'm not going to have that done on this uh, this episode. As a matter of fact, this is going to be a short episode. Showing you the server. Where I've chosen to set up base. And um, let's just go over here and look at the one deal. The, uh, the Guardian Temple. Because I was checking this out. I saw a crafting table I didn't place, so I was checking that out. I have not seen anyone else on here, and I even posted that uh, on a little map that I circled. Saying, this is me. And it got lava right there. And we're almost there. That's how close it is. I think I want to set up... Ooh, food. Set up a nice little uh, guardian farm. Of course... All my farms anyone can use. Oh, we're almost there. We're okay. The sign's over there. Okay, there's the guardian right there. Guardian temple. I'll put a sign right there. So, yep. Nice little guardian temple. Just not notice that. I didn't see that before. Oh, yeah. I think I did see that when I was out swimming around. So, yeah, you can see the entrance right there, even. So, uh, We'll definitely be getting set up. Probably put some beds on there. Get some guys over here. So we'll have to do an episode on uh, ransacking that guardian temple. And then I think it's going to be setting up a farm right there. Because that's pretty close to spawn. Spawn's not that far away. So that means it'll be a short trip through the... Uh, um, through the nether. Once we have that all set up. Because I don't know. I haven't been to the nether yet. I know... There is a portal at spawn, but that, that's probably going to be our next episode, is us going to nether and trying to get blaze rods. Because yeah, we need blaze powder and blaze rods for potions. Very important regen. That way I don't have to go using other people's stuff to get regen. But I think that is where we're going to call it. Um, like I said, short episode. Uh, these are probably going to be shorter episodes. Um, my plan is to do more of a look, see what I did. Because it's, let's face it, there's not a lot to show when you're building. Um, it's more of this is what I built. If I get into some redstone contraptions, I might show how I'm doing some of that. Uh, but a lot of it's going to be I'm going to do this and here's what I built. So uh, hopefully you get that that's uh, appealing to someone that they want to see what I come up with. Yep, I want to thank you guys for watching. If you liked what you've seen, hit the like button. Let me know what you think uh, down in the comments below on uh, the kind of format of this is where I built and this is where I'm at. Uh, hopefully, I'll even start off and show you right here. You know, like I'm like kind of like I did with the uh, the uh, mob farm over there. Um, this is where I found what I done. This is what I'm going to do, and then show you what I come up with. Uh, I know a lot of the other guys on here do does that to a point and. Uh, seems to work out for well for them and it's just it's really hard for me to commentate on building it's not my strong suit so it takes some practice for me and hopefully let me know what you think of this building because i'm kind of proud of it it really turned out i haven't done anything like this before and i figured with the uh ocean right here and the island definitely gonna do some docks build a ship island made it being kind of steampunky i don't know yet still trying to figure that out but again i want to thank you guys for watching and hit the like button, share the video how you want, and go, go look at the other guys' videos. All the links will be in the description. And until next time, guys, bye.